Hey, what's up guys? Brian here, Brian's Law Maintenance. Trust you guys are doing well. So it is another day in paradise. Actually, it is about 30 degrees out and snowing, believe it or not, today. But I uh, wanted to just spend a few minutes with you guys and talk to you about my 2018 marketing materials. Now, uh, a lot of you guys have been uh, asking me over the last couple of weeks. You guys know I do a lot of with reviews and marketing and just talking about my lawn and landscape business. And I wanted to show you guys uh, my new postcards, my, po my, my postcards that I do have, I should say, my new uh, lawn signs, and then my new polos. A lot of you guys were asking me, I saw them on Instagram how they all turned out so let me uh, <clears throat> spend a few minutes with you guys just showing you what we got uh, by the way this is as real as it gets uh if you guys can see, I've got the yard signs in the back. I'm going to be passing them out this weekend. I've got the polos in the box, and then I've got mirrors literally in my back seat, which is for the wife uh, for her Etsy business. So it never ends here. I'll show you guys uh, how a regular day in the life work truck looks. I've got the Joby Gorilla Pod, the polos, my Volt gloves. Actually, watching Johnny Mo. If you guys don't know, Johnny Mo is back, which is awesome. And I uh, just got done shaving and having my coffee. So. Anyway, it never really ends, man, when you guys do this kind of stuff. Uh, just a little time, uh, time stamp for you guys. It's uh, Thursday or Wednesday afternoon, whatever it is. And, dude, like the season is here for a lot of you guys in the south. But up here in the Midwest and the Northeast, dude, it's just like frozen. Uh, we actually got one to three inches uh, forecasted for tonight going into tomorrow, which is not cool because I plan to do cleanups the next uh, two or three days. <clears throat> so... This is real as it comes, man. I know a lot of you guys in the South are cutting grass like in uh, Virginia and Kentucky. I'm like, dude, Jelly 5K. So leave me a comment down below. Are you guys mowing grass yet or are uh, you guys still with me just uh, sitting on your thumb? I uh, wish you could go cut grass. But uh, so let's get into it. Here's my uh, yard signs. A lot of you guys were asking about this. And guys, I don't really have like any agenda on this video. I just want to share with you guys what I'm doing for 2018. Uh, right now, my goal is to add about 30 new lawn clients this year, uh, which will take us to about 130, 150-ish, uh, somewhere around that range. Um, now, that's a couple of huge commercial accounts in there too. So, uh, But that's uh, where I want to add about another $20,000 to my income this year by doing that. Uh, that'll be really, really nice. And uh, that's just kind of my goal for my lawn business this year. Um, you guys know I got the trailer signage, by the way. If you didn't see the previous video, check that out. Uh, this guy right here is my trailer, or I'm sorry, my yard signs. Uh, I changed it up a little bit from the, the previous years. This right here is a 12 by 18. So it says spring uh, cleanups, core aeration, and mulch installation. These are great, man. If you guys are starting your lawn business, uh, I got 20 or 25 of these for 250 bucks. Can't really beat that. Uh, that's what the stakes included, which are in this box. And they're like the, the, the nice like plastic stakes, not the metal ones that flex, you know what I mean? Um, but anyway, I gotta go put these out here in the next couple of days on the street corners. And one reason, I'll just give you guys a tip, I, you went with the 12 by 18s, is because the city doesn't take these as much, okay? Uh, that's that's pretty much it. The, I had the 18 by 24, the big signs. They were really um, obtrusive, like a lot of people were not uh, digging them, uh, so the city would take them a lot. Uh, so anyway, that's the uh, new signs. Let me see what else I got for you guys. A lot of you have uh, been asking about my postcards, even though I've done a couple videos on them. Let's see if I can get this to focus on the camera. Uh, all right, so there we go. This is my postcard, and honestly, I got uh, two or 2,500 of these again for about two and a quarter, 250. Uh, that was already with my artwork uh, set up and designed. So, uh, Brian's Law Maintenance, you guys can see it here. I'll go like this. If you want to pause the video, snap. All right, you can see uh, whatever you want on that. Um, so, I'm going to be passing those out this year. Last year, I ordered uh, a couple hundred of them, right? And I did not even uh, pass out a single one. Uh, I'll be honest with you guys, like I should have, but I didn't really need the business as much because uh, we had so much other stuff going on. I wasn't really uh, trying to expand my business that much, just making sure the camera's in focus here. Um, so anyway, uh, really excited about passing those out. Like I said, I've got 2,500 uh, of them sitting uh, in my trailer where we're gonna pass those out. And a lot of you guys ask me like, hey, what's the most effective uh, form of advertising? To be honest with you, my business model, I haven't dialed it in. You know, I, I, I call it the Blitzkrieg campaign where I do postcards, uh, I got the trailer signage now, which is awesome. We've got yard signs, I do customer referral programs. Um, I don't really do door hangers, but I do postcards and put them on mailboxes, obviously. Uh, but man, I call it the Blitzkrieg. Like, in a small business owner guy like, like us, 
you don't have so many but so many resources right like i don't have uh, an ad agency or like a marketing department to tell me what's most effective dude i get business from the lady walking down the street in her robe wait wave you know waving me over to you know phone calls from postcards which are a really good source of uh, new business for me and then um obviously i got the trailer signage i'm really excited about that that's going to be more for branding but uh, we'll definitely get some calls from that so got the yard signs got the postcards and then number three these are the new polos i uh wish i could set the camera down a little bit but check out the logo i don't know if you guys can see this uh it turned out really really nice now these are a lot of you guys have been asking me these are uh Her Harriton or harrington h-a-r-r-i-t-o-n if you're looking for polos these are 100 percent polyester these are not cheap though um i think the polo was about 20 dollars a polo embroidery was like maybe 10 12 bucks um definitely not a cheap route i got 16 of these i've got uh gray ones as well let's see what i can do for you guys check this out all right so this is the gray um and do the the camera and the color doesn't do it justice i i don't really color grade my videos you know what i mean guys like i don't i don't really care that much but um so anyway i've got 14 gray polos and i got two black ones for like gie and you know if i go to a trade show something like that uh but i but me and my guys we're going to be cutting grass in uh all the gray ones i didn't want black obviously right so i got 14 of those and all these by the way uh turn the brightness up a little bit all the uh all these polos by the way run a size like larger than what they should be so a medium is actually like a small so i've got uh like eight or ten smalls i've got uh like four uh mediums which are like largest i got two larges which are like extra large so if you guys go with these again it's a uh, harriton i don't know man i can't even say it h-a-r-r-i-t-o-n so if you guys are looking for these 100 percent polyester this is like their gray their dark gray i don't know what you call it and then obviously i got the black but i just uh i wanted to get some polos for the guys and uh the reason sorry going all over with the camera guys the reason i wanted to do um now the polo is 100% with a collar is to take our branding and our professional uh, look to the next level, obviously. Uh, these are not cheap. I'll be honest with you, this is like four or 500 bucks. All right, guys. Uh, but number two, the polyester is great because they're really breathable. My my gray Brian's Law Maintenance shirts that you guys have seen, those are uh, like a cotton shirt. So they you can get sweaty, you get sweat marks and stuff like that, and you, you're going to bleed through them in the armpits, uh, not to be gross, but in like July, August. So I wanted a polyester option as well. Uh, so anyway, that's what I'm doing for my marketing. I don't really know if there's anything else I could show you guys all right let's do this really quick I can show you guys the trailer I know it's really bright out but uh, here's another walk around of the trailer so I'm excited about the branding going to the next level on that again it's sunny out so it's kind of it's kind of tough here guys but and then I didn't really get to show you guys the uh, the backside as well but it looks really really cool man so for what it's worth you know I really like the uh, stickers going down the road on the trailer all right guys i'll be honest with you it's really really nasty out again it's blowing snow it's whipping cold again we're supposed to get one to three inches tonight i'm like not really digging that so i don't know when you guys watch this video but i'm excited about cutting grass and uh the spring conditions right so anyway for what it's worth but uh, all that being said, I'm going to wrap this one up. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I got a couple of awesome good uh, videos coming down the road this rest of this week. Hopefully we get some time to shoot them, right? Uh, going to be busy working. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this one, just want to do a little bit more off the cuff. I had the camera with me and have been meaning to do this. Again, got the polos, the signs, and the postcards. And man, we're going to hit it with the Blitzkrieg, I call it. Um, you guys call it whatever you want. I'm not here to <laughs> make it fancy and impress you guys with it. But all that being said, I uh, wanted to say a big thank you for you guys for checking out the channel. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new. Always doing uh, tips and uh, videos and reviews like this and uh, helping you guys grow a lawn and landscape company, obviously. And uh, I really appreciate the time. So if you guys enjoyed it, shoot a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new. And I look forward to catching up with you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.